So we've just arrived at Jerez oil field at the processing center and there is a great big blackened tower here that has been smashed by one of the incoming missiles or drones. I mean, it really looks like a sort of miniature version of Chernobyl. So what we're looking at here is what's called a separation tower. This is where Kharis oil field, part of Saudi Aramco's operations, separates out the gas and the oil from the crude mix that comes out of the ground. This is what they've got to do before they can even transport it and export it. It is the vital beating heart of this country's oil economy. And that's really what this country depends on. This is one of nearly two dozen sites here in a place called Uptake. And as you can see from the repair work going on there, it got hit by one of a flurry of missiles that came in in the early hours of Saturday morning. The Saudis still don't know for certain exactly who fired them and from where. There can be few more graphic examples of the country's critical infrastructure getting targeted. Now, the Saudis say they're confident they can repair the damage and have production back up to where it was by the end of September. What they can't say with any confidence is whether they can prevent such an attack happening again.